Well, tonight, Florence police anticipate criminal charges will be filed against a Gallatin County man who tried to break his cousin out of a local hospital and secretly recorded the whole altercation. Fox 19's Corey McConnell has been checking it out all day long and joins us with the story. Corey? Well, Dan, Ronnie Smith says his cousin asked him for help on Saturday. He says she was being held against her will at St. Elizabeth Florence. He says he was protecting a family member. Tonight, we have the video that he posted on YouTube and the other side of the story. This YouTube video has more than 300 views since Saturday. You guys got drugged up? It was shot inside the Behavioral Health Center at Saney Florence. The patient, whose identity we've protected, is this man's cousin. Ronnie Smith says he went to Saney on Saturday armed with an undercover camera to, quote, rescue his cousin, who he says was being imprisoned. It's illegal to sit in the hall mm -hmm. for 72 hours. Show me the law. Who reported this? The ER. Although the hospital told Smith that his cousin was suicidal when she was admitted, Smith says she's epileptic and cut herself during a seizure. She wouldn't show me the authority. She said it was the doctor, so I asked to see the doctor. He wasn't there. And uh, I asked to see if there's anyone else there that had the authority to hold her. No one else was there. However, Kentucky Commonwealth statute states that anyone who is deemed to be a danger to themselves by a physician can be placed under a 72-hour legal hold. Ronnie Smith nor any of his family wanted anything to do with the hold. Come on. I asked them to buzz me out. They wouldn't buzz me out, so I opened the door myself. Smith and his family hurried to the elevators. While they're trying to get to the exit, St. Elizabeth's security is called. After that, chaos. My family. Smith's cousin is ultimately pulled from the elevator by hospital personnel kicking and screaming. Smith claims he recorded this video to expose the system. He says they were in it for the insurance money. Make sure that everyone could see how they stop someone from hurting themselves. You know, this was all done to stop her from hurting herself. It looks to me like they've inflicted much more damage on her and her family than she could have ever done by herself. St. Elizabeth issued us a statement this afternoon calling Smith's claims that his cousin was kidnapped, quote, unfounded. The statement goes on to say that the hospital's first priority is, quote, to care for the health and safety of our patients. At times, family members may not understand the treatment requirements of our patients or may disagree with them. We regret that a community member posted these images on the Internet in violation of our patients' privacy. Corey McConnell. Fox 19 News. Ronnie Smith has other YouTube videos. He is running for Gallatin County Sheriff, promising to legalize marijuana.